Alright, in today's video, I will show you how to make little HO scale signs for your model railroad. I'll let this thing focus. Uh, focus. Uh, of course, it's not focusing. Anyways, so, things you're going to need soda can, false wood, something to act like a pole, scissors, maybe an X Acto knife, depends. Uh, a printed sheet of signs to scale, glue, some like super glue or something, white out, glue stick. So, first thing you want to do, you want to cut out the sign and leave a little bit of white just like I've done right here. And then with the glue stick, glue it onto the soda can, just like that. And then you're going to see these gray outline lines around. Don't cut those off because those are what they actually look like. So, yeah. I'll show you what you do next. Alright, now once you've glued and cut the soda can part off, first of all, make sure you glue the paper part like this, on to the colored part of the soda can so you have that nice silver background. And of course, clean your soda can because that'd be disgusting. But yeah, I'll show you the next step. So with the balsa wood, I cut out, or the bass wood, I've cut out a tiny little, almost like a bar. And um, yeah, so next you want to cut it to what you think like the pole of a sign, the street sign or something would look like. So, like that, and then kind of imagine what it would look like. Um, I'll cut it to my scale that I have, so I'll be back. Alright, so here we have it. Our cut little piece of boss, basswood. And you want to get your white out and sort of paint it. White out works best because it dries very fast. So I'll come back once I'm done painting, well, painting the white out. All right, so this is what the, uh, <laughs> those pieces there. Uh, this is what the pipe or the bar is gonna look like, just a piece of wood. You know, painted with white out. Doesn't matter what type you have, just like, it needs to be kind of the painting one, if it's the one that you hold the stripper down and it goes like that, but it's not really going to work. Uh, but yeah, and you want to get something like super glue. This thing is pretty good. Uh, and then glue it onto the back of the sign. Don't put too much in it. Um, I've made that mistake too many times. Uh, so, get like a little drop, droplet of it. And then glue it to the back of your sign in an appropriate place. Kind of even out your sign, and boom, you have an HO scale sign. Uh, really simple. You can do it at home. If you don't have basswood or balsa wood, you can order it off Amazon for dirt cheap. It's very cheap wood. Uh, you can even use like cardboard, uh, cardstock. But, uh, yeah, and I'll show you what the layout's sort of looking like right now. I have a, as you can see, I'm in a new setup, as I was in the last video, and I actually have an HO scale layout now, so here it is. It's in progress, and then there's a mountain I made, a bunch of my train pictures, if you can see it. I'm using the selfie camera, so. And then the Royal Hudson, favorite locomotive of all time. That's about it. Let it dry. This stuff dries pretty fast. And then, you know, set it on your railroad somewhere. I've placed mine, my other one, close to a mountain. So, yeah. I really hope this helped you, and if it did, uh, subscribe, leave a like, comment, whatever you want to do. Don't even do that. If you don't want to, just pop in and say hi. But, yeah, that's about it. Till next time.